Oh, we have to go down this thing again. Oh, my nose! Oh, oh boy, I'm gonna sneeze. Hang on. <coughs> oh! Oh, I hurt my back on that sneeze. Shit. That hurt. I can't get down! There's like an invisible barrier. What the hell? I don't know why I'm so sniffly today. Maybe it's to change weather. Maybe it's my allergies. Oh, that was close. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Save me! <laughs> you dick, I'm gonna kill you. Really? It's following me all the way up here? I'm just gonna jump all the way down. And die. No. Where the fucking... There you are. You know what? I don't like the Vex very much. I'm gonna die again. Ah, get away from me. Oh, got him. All right, you know what? I think I might have doubted the golden gun a little bit too much. It does save my butt a lot. All right, these, these harpies are, uh, they gotta go. Ah! You will die! Oh my god, that was so close. Alright, what did I get? Oh boy, I got a token! Yay! I'm going. Oh! I didn't realize this was a public event. Whoops. That's what sucks about hand cannons, is they take forever to reload. Huh. They'd rather blow up equipment than let us take it. These Cabal don't have a lot of faith in us, do they? I have no idea why that might be. Is this seriously worse? I mean, it gives me more resilience, but I don't know. Oh, I got a sidearm. I can get rid of this one. The general rule of thumb in uh, Destiny is... I think it's still a general thing, but once you start getting a lot of blues, that's when you can start just Ignoring greens. Well, maybe not really, but Captain, I have identified multiple data rich caches to plunder. I have created an unauthorized login for the friendly ghost. The Vex will believe he is one of them. Ideally, they will share their secrets. That's actually very helpful of you. Let's see what we can learn. Uh, shoot. 
Yeah, basically... Once you, uh... Well, it's not really once you start getting blues, it's more like when the greens kind of, uh... Or an experiment. Reach their like, like max account. level. I don't know what the cap is for it. I think it's like 200. Oh. Huh. That's strange. We gotta go. Failsafe, this login is perfect. I'm pulling all kinds of data on Cabal's shit. Machines. Zavala will love this. I was afraid I wouldn't make the jump. Marking additional caches. got another upgrade point that I forgot about. Ooh, we got six times six shots now. Ooh, what's that? I got a new emblem. Oh, snap. Look at that. I'm gonna use this one. Ooh, that looks nice. I don't know if everything just looks more red here because I was looking at a red screen or what. I don't know. Whatever. Do these things disappear? These better not disappear. Alright, we're good. I think they're onto us. They believe you are one of them. What did you ask? Nothing. I asked them what they're doing on this planet. Did I offend them? Uh, probably. I could be taken the wrong way. I'd be like, what are you doing in my town, you vex? A little bit racist. Or that's what it could come off as. Oh, hello. These data cores the Vex are dropping. They contain answers to my questions. Perhaps they are attempting to interface with the friendly ghost, and you, Captain, are in their way. I'm so sorry. I'll fix this. I can't get them to stop. They want to tell me about the Virgo prohibition and how its algorithms are wrongly deployed for the Mars environment. How is that even relevant? They say you lack a holistic perspective. According to the network, they are sending you help. I don't want their help. know why Asher's ghost never talks about her encounter with the Vex. They keep telling me to come home. Anyway, this data is too valuable to pass up. There's one more access point at the top. Okay. I'm gonna go this way. It seems safer. Actually, I'm not sure about that. All right, we're good. Ooh, found an engram. Friendly ghost, bad news. The collective is dispatching. 
using a Vex mine to help you terminate the captains. Tell them to stop. So sorry. I have no way to do that. But the Vex seem to like you very much. Oh, shoot. Okay, that's uh, that's not good. Run. Damn it. That mind said one last thing as it died. It's a Tell you what, the the stupid ground turning into green like that. Galaxy, it kind of annoying. Simulate. Probably old news to Ikora. But I'll ping the vanguard. Your query has terminated, Ghost. The Vax Collective hopes it has answered all of your questions. A user within the network oh, shit. Osiris sends his regards. Oh, Ikora definitely needs to know about that. All right. All right, next up, we've got this mission. Okay, okay, I'm getting lit up. What the fuck? Excuse me, I already killed you. I really wish I had a sparrow. I think I saw there was there's sparrows in engrams. Uh but I'm not sure about that. But that could be the way we get a sparrow is just hope that an engram drops one or something. Or we have to buy one. I don't know if we're gonna get one in the story. I would hope we would. I think we have to go this way. I mean, I could have dropped down, but I don't trust myself. Maybe we'll get a sparrow for beating the game, I don't know. But it would be really helpful. Oh, hi there. Unfortunately, I don't have any void damage on me, so... Some gauntlets on there. All right. Stop it. I'm trying to look at my gear, and you're shooting me in the back like a bunch of assholes. That's the wrong button. Great. Oh, great. I'm getting shot again. You motherfuckers. I'm gonna kill you. Again. I will kill you all day. I hear you. How the fuck? Oh, you son of a bitch! I don't know, 
it seems like the enemies in this game are a lot more aggressive. Yeah, not so tough now, are you? Oh look, you're back. Get the fuck out of here. Hey team, I know how we can hook failsafe up to the Nessus core and mine all the data we could ever want. Just help me place these beacons and I'll explain. Oh my gosh, how many are there? Like, where... You know, I wish it would mark them on the map. Although, if we're in a small area, it wouldn't really help. I don't know. I guess it would... Well, we can go over here. Let's jump. Jump! Okay. These beacons should allow us to hook Failsafe into the Nessus core. Think of all the data she could pull. It is a proactive and clever plan, friendly ghost. I still think it's a bad idea. Right. Uh, okay. Uh, looks like there's one up here. This will work, trust me. You know how I usually hack and scan stuff for us? I do. This one's all you. Oh, fun. Ooh, look at that. Hey, we got a scout rifle. And we got more shaders. I think that was worth it. Alright. Let's unlock the Nessus core. Damn rocks. Oh. Uh, man, my nose is just... bothering me. Hopefully I don't sound too sniffly or nasally or anything. Or more than usual, I should say. Oh dear. I'm so sick. No. Oh. I hope I'm not sick, I don't know. Alright, so... Um, for Destiny, so I don't know, I feel comfortable playing Claw for this game. It feels weird if I don't, just because there's a lot of jumping in this game. Um, but in terms of like, gunfights and stuff, is... Where am I going? Yeah, I'm not gonna... Oh man, there's a guy here. I should probably help. I should probably help. I'm gonna... The fallen are feeding on that servitor. That is very bad news. Please stop them. Alright. Uh-oh. Yeah, I like the scout rifle. No. Oh, 
Wasn't I already in this event? Come on, buddy. Oh, come on. Ah, damn it. This is not good. I might die. Fuck. I didn't drop right. I I jumped way too early when I was dropping down. That was a stupid, stupid move on my part. Why? Oh, come on! I. Oh, uh, I tried to press X. I didn't expect to drop that fast. Oh, damn. I'm lost. Oh, God. Get me out of here. What the fuck? Oh, we did it. Fucked. Man, we had like 23 seconds left. Yeah. Servitors make sentient machines look bad. I'm sorry, that's impossible. I always look good. All right. So what did I get out of that? Oh, we got a we got an auto rifle. Sweet. Man, we're not, we don't have any good armor. I mean, we're not getting more powerful armor. All right. So before I was saying, uh, in Destiny, I don't know how, like, do people jump shot a lot? Is that like a thing you should be doing? Because I don't think you should. Core is open. Get ready, failsafe. I am practicing my best Vex impressions. Please do not let them capture me, Captain. Just treat it like tightrope walking. Don't think about it. You're not helping. <clears throat> Connect failsafe to the Nessus. Alright. Hang on. You never know if we're gonna need these. So, with jump shotting... Jumping actually hinders you quite a bit. So for one, you lose your accuracy. I believe in you. If they kill me, I will haunt your shell. No. Oh great. Well, Better hope this works, ghost. All right. Ow. I have interfaced with the Nessus core. See? Easy. Grab everything that's not nailed down. The Vex are attempting to impede my progress. There should be a conflux nearby. Please stabilize it for me. 
So yeah, when you're jump shotting, Thank you, Captain. you... Now eliminate those data cubes. They contain security protocols that are blocking my progress. You're a pro. I knew this could work. The Vex are fighting back. I have marked other confluxes for stabilization. Destroy the cubes they generate. Uh oh. So, when you jump shot, you lose your accuracy and you also kind of make yourself an easier target to hit in a way. Like, even though you can, like, jump out of their line of sight and, uh,. You can jump out of their, you know, you jump, then they have to like move their crosshair up and try to track you. But I feel like most players are good enough to, uh... They're actually good enough to, you know, not be disoriented by that. Plus, when you're in the air, you actually move a lot slower. So it's kind of like, is there really a point to trying to jump shot and all that stuff? I, I don't know. To me, strafing around would be a lot better than than trying to like jump and shoot the enemy. I don't know, because with strafing you don't really lose your speed a whole lot. With jumping, you kind of go, uh, and you just kind of float there a little bit. Safe. The Vex have sent a mind after us. Fail safe? Any updates? Okay, so she's been captured by the Vex. I'm so sorry. I can fix this. Get me the data core from that mind. Actually, I have a super. How did that guy go? He just run away? I guess. I don't think I can make that jump. So basically my question is, is there a reason to uh, play claw or play with a scuff or something so that you can jump shot in well, mainly Destiny. Fuck. Mainly Destiny, but also in other shooters like Call of Duty. Now, is there a reason, like... I don't know. Like an advantage? I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. God damn it. <sighs> I spawn all the way down here.
Oh my god, there's just so many enemies that are just shooting at me. I'm gonna sit in the corner for a bit. Got a freaking hobgoblin over there. You know what? I'm pretty sure I was fighting the high value target. That's probably what he was. He wasn't even part of the freaking mission. That's great. Alright. No, he's still here. I'm stuck. Are you fucking kidding me? move on. Yeah, so basically, is there any reason to play Claw or play with a Scuff? That's pretty much what I'm asking. I mean, it's nice when you can... It's gotta be in here somewhere. Help me get rid of the interference from these confluxes, and I should be able to lock onto her location. It's nice when you can, you know, have all your movements done without without removing your thumb from your uh, right stick that you can aim. But I don't think it's worse, worth it if your aim ends up being worse uh, because you're trying to play Claw. I don't know. I've gotten to the point where it kind of feels natural to me. Mainly in Destiny. Uh, I don't know why. Maybe it's because there's like... I don't know, it just feels weird to not be able to jump and, you know, move your uh, crosshairs Okay, that was stupid. Whoops. I should have expected that one. I don't know, it just feels right when you can move your crosshairs around while you're jumping. Because there are a lot of... There are a lot of platforms in this game. Like... Like, you do need to jump on- oh, jeez. Like, you do need to, uh, you know, jump on, like, like, say you're down here. There's a lot of jumping up, just jumping up in general. So it's nice to kind of be able to, you know, jump and still move your crosshairs so you're jumping exactly where you want to. But in a game like Call of Duty... Uh, I can't really play Claw because... Uh, they have a lot of semi-automatic weapons in that game. And most of the time it's an uncapped fire rate. So, so you want to pull the trigger as fast as you can to shoot. 
This one, it's just... I'm trying to pull it as fast as I can, but... It doesn't matter how fast I pull the trigger here. In uh, Call of Duty, you pull it fast and you fire fast. And that's what... So I can't do that when I play Claw. I don't, I don't know. I just want to know if there's a reason to do that. Thank you, Captain. I have spent the last decade speaking with a fellow prisoner. A decade? It didn't take us that long. Time must work differently within the network. He was a very good listener. It's a shame I couldn't take him with me. He showed me a myriad of potentialities for this galaxy. How the Vex intend to shape them? I will share with your vanguard. I'm so sorry I put you through that. But you did. And I never forget those who wrong me. Oh dear. <laughs> You're in trouble, little light. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's funny. Ooh, got another auto rifle. Got a better helmets. I'm gonna need to go through and clean this up. Alright. So, yeah. I guess the reason I'm asking is because I've been thinking about getting a scuff, but, you know, freaking 200 bucks is a lot to spend on a controller. I kind of don't want to do that. And I don't think I really have to, anyway. Because for the most part, I'm pretty comfortable with playing Claw. Except for in Call of Duty because it hinders my uh, trigger finger. Um, but in Destiny, it feels alright. The only thing is, if I'm using a semi-automatic weapon, I can't really fire and like... Like if I were to revive that guy. I'd have to hold square, but then it would be really hard for me to fire. Because, uh... You know, you have to stretch your fingers out pretty far. Damn. You know what? I like this auto rifle. Where'd you go? machines look bad. I'm sorry, that's impossible. I always look good. You have found an object filled with lost power pressed. Okay. Oh. Hang on. Oh look, I found my other one. My other uh, subclass. Kindle your lost abilities by defeating enemies and fighting alongside fellow guardians of public events. This is not a normal arrow. When you hold it, you can feel the pieces hum. The subtle fluctuations feel familiar. Oh man, I got so much crap in here. Oh, we're definitely getting better gear now, so that's nice. Actually, I do have a... Sp I think I have a point to spend. I have a bunch of points to spend.
I mean, I could just... Do these carry over? They do. Hmm. Well, maybe I'll save the rest of the points for when I, you know, unlock this. What? What is this? Kind of like this one better. I like blue colors a bit more than well, cool colors. I like cool colors colors a bit more than warm. <laughs> 